Hello friends, in this video we are going to be going through number 16 from the math test inside test 1 in your red book. So take a couple seconds, pause your video, flip to number 16, give it the old once over and then we will fly through it together in just a second. Alrighty, so here is what's happening in this question. They give you this picture, it's got this triangle with some line, the points are all labeled, it gives you a couple of the angles. And bottom line, they want you to find the, the measure of this angle, DEF, in degrees. And in order to answer this, this, this question, in order to get this question correct, you have to know about two different things. We have to know about supplementary angles, and we have to know about the, the interior angle sums of triangles, right? So basically what a, what a supplementary angle is, it's two angles that add up to 180 degrees, right? So if I look at these two angles down here, EDF and EFD, I notice that we are given CDE. We need to find this guy right here, if my marker will work, we need to find this guy, EDF. And in order to find angle EDF, we have to know that since this is a straight line right here, since this is a straight line, this angle, 148, plus this angle must add up to 180 degrees, okay? So this whole thing has to be 180 degrees. This, this whole angle has to be 180 degrees. So in order to find what, let's say, the measure of angle EDF, is equal to 180, 180 degrees, minus this chunk, 148. And we do 180 minus 148, you can do this in your calculator. You get 32. So this little angle right here is 32 degrees. All right. Now let's do the same thing over here. We want to find the measure of angle E, F, D. Same thing, since this is a straight line, this whole thing has a measure of 180 degrees. So this piece right here is if we took our whole 180 degree angle and took away our 140. So this angle is equivalent to 180 degrees minus that 140 degrees. And what you're left with, again, you can use your calculator if you need to, is 40 degrees. So this guy right here is 40 degrees. So now we know two, the measures of two out of three of our angles inside of this triangle. And this is where that second piece comes into play, where you have to know about the interior angle sums of a triangle. And what this means is any triangle, if you add up all three angles inside that triangle, you will always get 180 degrees. There are always 180 degrees inside of a triangle. Right, so if we call this angle, well, let's just call it question mark, we know that since this is a triangle, we know that 32 degrees plus 40 degrees plus our mystery angle, question mark degrees, equals 180 degrees. It has to. These three have to add up to 180. So if we want to find the measure of our mystery angle, which is measure of angle DEF, I'll write that down here measure of angle D, E, F. Well, if we solve for the measure of angle D, E, F, you know, we'll subtract 40 and we'll subtract 32 from both sides. 180 minus 140, I'm sorry, minus 40 is 140. 140 minus 32, that's 108 degrees. So the measure of angle D, EF must be 108 degrees, and that, my friends, is your answer.